You're a good, good father. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. And I'm loved by you. It's who I am. It's who I am. It's who I am. You're a good, good father. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. And I'm loved by you. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Innocent Sadiki. And if it's your first time joining us on my channel, please make sure you subscribe to the channel and keep up to date with this awesome um, spiritual Christian content um, that's very light-hearted, beautiful, and exciting. You know, actually, it was as I was walking downstairs to come and record, I thought to myself, do I really know what I want to talk about? And I felt like a small voice, a small voice say to me, faith cometh by hearing and hearing the word of God. And so the more they hear my word is the more they can believe. Woo! And I was like, what? The more they hear my word is the more that they will believe. And and it's 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 in his in it's in us reading the word of God, it's in us hearing the word of God that our faith is revived, our spirits are revived, that we're reminded actually about, about who we are. We're children of God and we constantly need to remind each other to say, hey, sister girl, you know, you need to be praying, you know, you need to do a pray check. When last did you pray, you know? So I'm that girl, I'm that sister to you to remind you to say, hey, sister, you need to be praying. Hey, sister, you need to be reading the word of God, you know? So I want to speak about faith today and as as this was um in my spirit that's that, that small beautiful voice that says that when they hear my word they will believe i decided yes let's talk a little bit about faith can we have a discussion about faith so i just want to read a few scriptures to you and let's discuss them all right so the first scripture that I'm going to read for you is comes from the book of Hebrews 11 verses 1 and it reads, Now faith is the assurance, note that assurance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen, not seen. These are things that we have not seen, we have not experienced them, not seen seen. So it is okay for you to have faith and believe in things that you have not even seen. You're not crazy. You're not delusional. You just have faith. That's what the Bible refers to as faith. Psalms 46 verses 10 says, be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted amongst the nation. I will be exalted in the earth. It is our duty and our responsibility as children of God to exalt God because it's, I will be exalted on earth. So who is on earth? Me and you. Who needs to exalt God? Me and you. So we constantly need to say, Lord, we love you. Lord, you are worthy. Lord, you are faithful. Heavenly Father, there is none like you. Nothing compares to you, King. You are mighty king of kings, my king. If you're a king, it makes me a king too because he's a king of kings. Thank you, Jehovah. Thank you. We worship you. That is exalting God. John 8, 24. Unless you believe that I am who I claim to be, you will die in your sins. Unless we do what we believe, it comes back to faith. What is faith? Believing things that are not seen so unless you believe so the bible says unless you believe you will die in your sins we need to believe we need to have faith everything about us as christians it's faith everything about us is, is belief like if i ask you now have you met jesus personally have have you seen him i mean did you see him heal people did you did you walk with him are you one of the 12 disciples no how do we know that Jesus is real? Because we've got faith. How do we know that the Holy Spirit is, 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 is real? I know we feel him. I know we experience him. And I know for some of us, he has healed us. He has delivered us. We have, we have felt God. We have seen his goodness. But I'm talking about, have you seen him personally? No. We, we, we've seen him by faith. We believe by faith. All right. I'm going to read one more scripture. Romans 10, 17. 
reads so faith comes by hearing and hearing through the word of Christ this is why I wanted to talk about faith because the more we speak about Christ the more we preach about Christ the more people evangelize about Christ the more they sing about Christ the more you hear about it is the more your faith gets activated according to the book of Hebrews that's what the Bible says um, I will read it again. Oh, in the book of Romans, I said Hebrews. So faith cometh by hearing and hearing through the word of Christ. Through the word of Christ. Not through the word of whatever we might be familiar with uh, or whatever people might be talking about. But it's through hearing it. You know, um, I don't know about you, but when I listen to faith songs, when I listen to gospel music, my faith gets revived. My faith gets restored. When I hear um, um, a worship song, whether it's heal song, whether it's just celebration, whether it's is, uh, Busira the Boy, it's Taiki, whether it's anyone really African or traditional, whatever kind of gospel, anything that reminds me of who God is anything that speaks of Christ I I my faith gets renewed I believe again you know it doesn't matter how dead I am in the spirit of all of, of the kind of situation I'm in but I just believe again I just have faith again and and I sing again spirit lead me where my is without borders my faith be made stronger in the presence of my Savior. Woo! And I will call upon your name. I can't sing, but when I think about Jesus, everything that I hear activates my faith. What am I saying to you? Find yourself in positions where you can hear the word of God. Find yourself with a with company that speak the word of God. Find yourself with people that speak Jesus. Find yourself with 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 with, with songs and spiritual hymns that speak Jesus. And in that way your faith will be activated. Read books that have Jesus. Read books that have Christ in them. Romans says by hearing the word of God, hearing it through the word of Christ. Meaning my music needs to have Christ. My content that I watch needs to have Christ. The things that I listen to needs to have Christ. Listen, I know there's other things that we watch and that we listen to. You know, I, I love documentary, uh, watching documentaries. I love, you know, watching, you know, I'm of course, I'm, I'm a YouTuber, so I watch a lot of YouTube videos. There's a lot of things that I'm interested in, but I make sure that within that context of everything that I watch, majority of things that i watch they need to be fulfilling to who i am which is my spiritual being which is my my spiritual life and that is what fills me and that is my advice to you today to say hear it hear it and by hearing it you'll believe it and and that's how your faith shall be renewed i want to sing a song for you all before i i close yes 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 yes, yes. you're a good good father it's who you are, it's who you are, it's who you are, and I'm loved by you. It's who I am, it's who I am, it's who I am. You're a good, good father. It's who you are, it's who you are, it's who you are, and I'm loved by you. Thank you, Jesus, for loving me. Thank you, God, for loving each and every person that's watching. Thank you so much, God, for your grace. Thank you for your favor. Thank you for your peace. Thank you for being a good, good father. Thank you for never changing. Thank you, God, that you are not like men. You remain the same. Thank you for your love that is ever consistent, God. You give us more than enough. Our cups overflow. Thank you, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you for ordering our steps. Thank you, Heavenly King. Thank you for choosing us first. Thank you for loving us first. Thank you for healing us thank you for delivering us thank you for your love thank you for your grace thank you for your peace thank you for our healing thank you for our well-being thank you for a peace of mind thank you for faith because faith is a substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen thank you god that we can tap into the spirit and begin to walk by faith thank you for faith god thank you that we can believe again we love you jesus we give you all the glory and the praises in the name of jesus we pray thank you God bless you. Until next time, subscribe. Mm -hmm.